Hello and welcome back to the Trainers of the World Tournament. I'm your host, Delta TDS, and today for match number 126, we've got the Indigo Champion Lance going up against the Hoenn Elite Force Sydney. Lance currently has a record of 4-0. He went 2-0 against Clay in round 1, and 2-0 against Tao back in round 2. Meanwhile, Sydney's currently got his own undefeated record against Marlin from last round. It looks like it's going to be a fun match between a, a champion and an Elite Four member. Lance has the uh, Mega Charizard X, while Sydney has the Mega Absol. Once these trainers are ready, we can begin at game number one. Lance starting off with the Tyranitar, setting up the Sandstream as Sydney leads off with that Mandibuzz, setting up a Tailwind as Tyranitar goes for Rock Slide, dealing 84% to Mandibuzz. Knockoff's gonna do 15% and get rid of the Wide Lens off that Tyranitar as it goes for a Dragon Dance. Brave Bird doing another 18% as Rock Slide does take out that Manda Buzz. And Sydney is down his first Pokemon. Sending out the Shift Tree. I think this is a Pokemon we've seen a bit of in Sydney's last round. Leaf Blade gonna do just under a third to Gyarados. And. Sydney's Tailwind does peter out. Shift Tree going for a Sword Stance as Gyarados sets up, goes for a Thunder Wave. Wave. Wait. Does... I don't know what's happening right now. I did not think Gyarados had Thunder Wave. I even made the team. What the hell? Okay. Uh, Haxorus with the superpower takes out that shift tree and reveals that Haxorus does have that life orb. For some reason, I thought that was like a Zoroark, but I was like, no, wait. Zoroark's on Sydney's team. Night Days takes out that Haxorus. Uh, speaking of Zoroark. Lance sending out the Dragonite, gonna do a quarter to the uh, to it as it sets up a Dragon Dance. Another Night Days does 43% as Outrage takes out that Zoroark. Absol going for the Sucker Punch, taking out that Dragonite. And Lance sends out the Tyranitar again. Starting up the Sandstream once more. And switching out to the Charizard. As Absol goes for a close combat, dealing a third to that Charizard. Switching back out to the Tyranitar as Absol attempts to go for a Sucker Punch, but is unable to. Switching out to the Garchomp as Absol goes for a Swords Dance now. Knockoff takes Garchomp down to the Sash as Earthquake does take out that Absol. It's currently 3v2 right now. Garchomp is on 1 HP right now. Going for the Protect as Garchomp starts in Outrage. And Sharpedo gets a Speed Boost. Waterfall does take out the Garchomp. And Lance is down to two Pokemon. Sending out the Charizard now. Gonna Mega Evolve. Waterfall taking Charizard down to 4%. Thunder Punch does take out the Sharpedo. And Sydney just has that Scrafty left. Intimidating that Charizard is gonna be helpful for Sydney here. Switching out to the Tyranitar, kick, starting up the Sandstream once more. Brick Break with a critical hit takes out Tyranitar. Now it's down to ch just Charizard and Scrafty. Dragon Claw 
dealing about two thirds as Poison Jab takes out the Charizard. And Sydney takes game number one. We saw a bit from Zoroark, we saw everything from the Absol, and then everything else we saw two to three moves from. As for Lance's team, we saw at least a move from everything. Uh, Tyranitar has the Wide Lens, Axorus has Life Orb, Garchomp has the Focus Sash. But we are back on the field for game number two, and once these trainers are ready, we can see if Sydney keeps his undefeated record or if Lance brings us to a game number three. Lance sending out that shiny Gyarados as Sydney starts off with that Mandibuzz. Different lead from Lance, but the same one from Sydney. We saw that Mandibuzz does has does have Tailwind. Going for the extra sensory, doing 30% to Gyarados as it goes for a Thunder Wave, paralyzing that Mana Buzz. Switching out to the Mana Buzz. Gyarados currently has a Dragon Dance set up. Going for the Ice Fang, doing two thirds as Mana Buzz sets up the Tailwind. Switching out to the Tyranitar, setting up the Sandstream. Brave Bird's going to do 20% as those leftovers heal up that recoil damage. I'm going to go for Roost as Tyranitar sets up a Dragon Dance of its own. Going for a second Dragon Dance, Manibu's going to knock off Tyranitar's Wide Lens. Scrafty switching in, gonna intimidate, get rid of one of those attack boosts as Tyranitar goes for a third Dragon Dance. This thing is strong, this thing is fast. And switches out to the Gyarados as Scrafty goes for a Brick Break. Interesting plays from the plants here. As Sydney switches out to the Scrafty that's paralyzed. Night Days is going to do 61% and lower that accuracy as Charizard Mega Evolves. Flare Blitz does take out that Zoroark, dealing over a quarter of recoil damage to Charizard. The first Pokemon has been KO'd in this game. Sydney is sending out that Sharpedo as it goes for a Protect and Charizard sets up another Dragon Dance. Going for a Thunder Punch, missing due to that accuracy drop and Waterfall does take out that Charizard. Lance sending out the Garchomp now. Waterfall is going to do over half to Garchomp and flinch it. Switching out to the Gyarados, intimidating the Sharpedo as it goes for Protect. Sharpedo is just stacking up speed boosts here. Switching to the Dragonite as Crush does under 20% to it. Gonna go for a Protect as Dragonite sets up or goes for an Outrage. Waterfall is gonna do 19% to Dragonite. Outrage does take out the Sharpedo. And Sydney is currently down to four Pokemon. Sending out the Shift Tree now. Circuit Punch is going to do a third to Dragonite. Outrage takes Shift Tree down to the Sash. And pickpockets the Yachi Berry. As Dragonite falls to Sucker Punch. Lance sending out that Haxorus now. Sucker Punch is going to do over a third as Super Power takes out that Shift Tree. Haxorus is currently down to 55% and has two attack drops. Switching out to the Gyarados, intimidating the Scrafty. Voice Jab is still enough to take out that Gyarados. 
and sending out the Garchomp now. Outrage is going to do nearly three quarters to that Scrafty. As Scrafty sets up a Dragon Dance. Yeah, I think he gets his as an egg move. Outrage is still enough to outspeed and take out the uh, Scrafty. Mandibuzz is sent out and Lance switches out to that Tyrantar. Mandibuzz getting paralyzed. Setting up a Dragon Dance, Mana Buzz paralyzed for a second turn in a row. I wonder if we'll see four turns in a row again. Nope. Mana Buzz finally gets that Tailwind off. Tyranitar goes for a third Dragon Dance, getting paralyzed again. Tyranitar is all set. It just goes for anything. And it could take out Sydney's team here. Tyranitar getting kind of greedy with the uh, dragon dances. Tailwind has petered out. Ooh, not greed if I need it. Rockslide does take out that Manda Buzz, and it's all down to Absol here. Gonna Mega Evolve. Rockslide takes out the Absol. And Lance with three Pokemon takes game number two. Kind of crazy just watching Dra Tyranitar stack up Dragon Dances. Stacking up boosts will never not be funny. But we didn't see anything from that Absol this game. I believe we saw everything from the Mandibuzz. We didn't see anything really new from Sydney's team. We know that the Dragonite has the Yachi Berry. Uh, we know that Gyarados has the Wukong Berry. We are back on the field for game number three. And Lance sends out that Gyarados as Sydney starts off with that Mana Buzz. Gyarados going for a Thunder Weight as Mana Buzz sets up a Tailwind. Switching out to the Shift Tree as Lance has Gyarados go for a Dragon Dance. Fake out's gonna do 15% to Gyarados. Getting some free damage in. Shift Tree setting up a Swords Dance as Gyarados paralyzes it as well. Shift Tree going for Sucker Punch, dealing 3 quarters to Gyarados. As Shift Tree is brought down to the Sash due to the Ice Fang and a pickpockets the Wakan Berry. I don't think we'll do much for Shiftry. Switching back out to the Gyarados, getting that Intimidate off. As Leaf Blade does take out the Gyarados with a crit fit too. Lance sending back out that Charizard. Gonna Mega Evolve. Shiftry is paralyzed and Charizard goes for a Dragon Dance. Sucker Punch is gonna do just under half to Charizard as Dragon Claw takes out that Shift Tree. And both trainers are now down to 5 Pokemon here. Sydney sending out the Sharpedo now. Going for Protect. Lance predicting that and going for a Dragon Dance on Charizard. Charizard with the Thunder Punch does take out that Sharpedo. Very swiftly, not letting it get faster than it. As Sydney sends out that level 95 Absol. Player Blitz takes out the Zoroark. And Charizard is left with a quarter of health left. Sydney sending out the Mana Buzz. Thunder Punch also takes it out. Now Sydney sends out the Scrafty, intimidating one of those attack boosts away. Dragon Claw takes out the Scrafty. And now it's all down to the real Absol here. Gonna Mega Evolve, Sucker Punch takes out that Charizard. Getting rid of that threat from Lance's team. Though Sydney does have four more Pokemon to go through. 
Yachi Berry is going to get knocked off as Dragonite goes for a Dragonair. Outrage does take out the Absol. And Lance with four Pokemon takes game number three, which means he'll be moving on to round four. Join us tomorrow where we will be seeing the Sinnoh Gym Leader Candice going up against the Galar Gym Leader Kabu. Thank you so much for watching and until then, take care.